He's like, this ain't ballet. He's... Gives a shit, man. It's fucking bright, but I gotta say, W's full of pussies, Jesus. Uh, welcome to the new age of life, okay? ABWF, however, is not full of pussies. Nah, hell no. We, we say our words and shit. Alright? We say... TARD! Is it? No. Is it? Nope. You don't want... I am officially canceling cancel culture because cancel culture is ridiculous and retarded. We got awesome Marco here coming out, teaming up with sit down. Marco, this, well, you want to talk about an unsafe work environment. This tag team match is an unsafe work environment. It's all unsafe. What the fuck? What difference does it make if you're in the ring or outside of it? You sign up for it. You literally sign up to potentially put your life on the line. A monitor get lunged at you and you, you have enough. Alright. Here's his boy, Rebel Kid. Very excited to see what uh, Rebel Kid has in store for, for us here. Ooh, I do. I, I'm really excited. Rebel Kid, I mean, he's been the background of this whole thing. Marco and him returned last week to try to put get their hands on Chris Sean. And now they, uh, I guess uh, Mr. Stein thought it was a good idea just to have a tag match happen. And, uh, well, here we are. Tag match. I'm excited, I guess. It's probably going to be a great fast-paced ass-beating. Bullstrom Rebel Kid used to be tag team partners, how they used to be in the Enforcer Violence together. History, man, they, they always intertwine with each other. And they both have done nothing but win badass championships. Ironic. Bullstrom was one of the most forgettable badass champions in history. That's the truth. Sorry if the truth hurts, but that's the truth. And man, here it is. Awesome Marco, Rebel Kid, teaming up. They're the U -W Team UWF still. Whatever that fucking means. You know what UWF stands for? No, no. Unsafe work forever. Here's Eddie X. Starting off with Marco, these two... EOV. All right. There we go. They're they're doing this for Chris Sean tonight. They want to make sure Marco and Rebel Kid are out of his hair. And hell, I I, I applaud them for trying. You see what I mean? This guy's already going nuts. We're already in the oh, final gear of this I match. I never feared my life more than that. Ring. Listen, hey. Don't 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 stink up this show with that pussy shit. Don't stink up the greatest wrestling I'm show say I know. Every ever. match, I don't. Oh care. man. Eddie X and Awesome Marco, they probably fight backstage the whole time. Anytime they find each it. other. Wow, this is fast. The people in the front row aren't even safe. No. There's even warnings at every event you go to. There we go. Yeah. Trying to do the same thing, but Eddie X is avoiding. Jesus. Oh, man, look at that. That is a clover leaf if I've ever seen a clover leaf. Whoa! Marco looks very motivated tonight to get through this part of the journey there's rebel kid man they're on the same page incredible work man look at that just destroying eddie x and here he is rebel kid looking at his former partner eddie x they've had a match one time on the purple edition of print so it's kind of you know oh man bullstorm is meat and there he is man it's bullstorm and rebel kid once again one on one in the middle of this ring. Bullstrom just looking at him like, hey, I'm gonna kill you. No. Okay, out of ya. Yeah. That guy ain't here tonight. He's suspended. Yeah, he made me feel unsafe. Oh, yeah, he attacked Opie Smith back. It was an unsafe working by. You gotta get suspended. Oh, man. Nice Russian takedown there. Nice, uh, maybe it was STO. I don't, I don't know, honestly. 
Man, that hurts your knee more than it hurts the guy. You're putting it to the knee, to the knee, to hurt the guy. Here's Austin Marco Bullstorm. Two UWF originals, done a lot together. I mean, everybody in this match is pretty much a UWF guy besides Eddie X. My God, look at that. Whoa, damn. Man, they are taking care of business in fast-paced mode. We're going to see what else. Oh, no. I got knocked out from just watching that shit. That's it. That's the game. One. Oh, never. Ooh, damn. One. You got kicked in the fucking head and you... Oh! Tried doing the spinning back fist. Oh, man, I thought he was going to powerbomb him, but this is a fast pace. Nowhere to grab Eddie X from. Oh, and there's Bullstorm. Oh, tried doing the air raid back fist, but also Marco had great uh, distance. And here he is, man. Marco is going fast mode. This is incredible. Where are you going, Bullstorm? That's a massive Phoenix Splash! This is fast pace. That's it. One, two. Oh, my God. How do you kick out of the Phoenix platform? former world champion, Austin Marco. First ever UWF world champion defeating MXL at Bloody Saturday 2020. Incredible main event. It was exactly as bloody as you'd want it to be. Marco is going absolutely haywire on the enforces of violence. Great action here tonight. We are seeing Marco go down with the violence machine and Warden is just watching this knowing he beat these guys before in an awesome six man including Warden in ring in action in the ring and man Marco is doing this reminds me of Marco versus Archangel when he went absolutely nuts and hit like seven finishers to make sure that he just beat that guy on a regular yeah. oh man here comes Eddie X he knows it's over if he doesn't break it up he knows it's over Oh! Try to super kick Eddie X, man. Eddie X is a street fighter. You think he hasn't fought three people at fucking once? Are you kidding me? But I guess uh, Rebel Kid and Marco have taken care of that part of the problem. And here's Bullstorm looking at what Marco is doing. He just misses. Look at Marco. He's fighting everybody. Impressive. Oh, it's kind of unsafe, man. Yeah, yeah, a little bit. This is an unsafe work environment. And man, Eddie X making sure he's staying down so Bolsham can get up at the same time. They are both back up. Oh! Oh my! That's a collision! That's one collision, man. That's a punk move right there. Punk ass move. Oh, wait a minute. This is illegal! Warden is getting involved again. I guess Warden's not doing anything physical except pushing him. That's not even fair. Eh, Wait a minute. Warden just got thrown out of the match. That's the price you pay. That's the price you pay, man. But Marco might still be down. One. Two. two. That would have been it, man. Uh, Warden just screwed their team by accident. But the damage done to Marco is going to pay off in the end. That's the strategy. He knows that this match is going to take a lot more than just a power bomb. But he knows that power bomb is going to be the key to win the match. But the referee made the right move. Spinning back fist, my God. Holy my God. Holy. The spinning back fist. Is Rebel Kid going to save his part one, one two, two. two? He's surviving all of the big issues here. That spinning back fist is the end of the game. Oh, Marco got him right at the last minute. And here he goes again. Oh, wait, he's not letting him do it again. He's not letting him do it again. And now he's going right to Eddie X to see if that monster of a man can do some work. And here they go, man. The tides have turned. The Warden Key powerbomb move is what turned the tides. It may have cost him that pinfall. But it sure as shit ain't going to cost him the match. Not at this point. This is a unsafe environment for Marco right now. No kidding. Yep. Yeah, that is an unsafe. That could break the ribs. That is unsafe. Like you said, man, you bring in a guy that's been shot before. This is what happens, man. Bullstorm kind of prevent Eddie. One. Wait a minute. Oh, and Bullstorm prevented Rebel Kid from getting involved. And he might ruin Marco's chances of winning. What a suplex. Oh, Marco avoided the move from Eddie X. That would have been the end of the match right there. It's just Marco alone against the enforcers. Of Wait, no, never mind. Rebel Kid's right there. Thank God. The Rebel Kid's still being around. 
He survived that suplex, got right back up knowing there's more important things to do than cry on the outside because you're hurt. Guess what? You sign up for it. It's an unsafe work environment. And oh my God, Eddie X popping out of that major move. Great teamwork here by the enforcers of Violent. Marco gets out of that situation. And here we go, unsafe work environment. Talk about unsafe. When you're on the outside of the ring, that's kind of, oh wait, no, Bullstorm, you son of a bitch. Oh my God. <laughs> Shit, that was, that was fucking awesome, dude. He was going to go to the top rope, and Bullstorm went, nope. <laughs> he said, ah, fire holy me. Shit. <laughs> holy shit. Holy shit. He was said, a, fire me. <laughs> that was a holy shit moment. Marco is fucked right now. He's trying to still fight. Unsafe, Wait a minute. Professional. They're right by the stairs. That's unsafe. Man, I'm going to make so many unsafe references when the most unsafe match that ever exists happened. Oh, my God. Oh, I that is that. unsafe. I mean, I don't even think he hit the stairs, but I think someone hit the stairs. And these two are just brawling on the outside right now. Oh, he is worn out. They're both worn out, man. This is a, a, a violent match tonight. Very intense match. Rebel Kid still needs that tag in, man. Marco needs to do the right decision and tag in Rebel Kid when the opportunity comes to do so. This is a uh, momentous tag match and a very important match to win. And here comes Marco right now doing what he has to do to confine oh my Eddie X that's incredible what a moonsault to the concrete wow. on concrete oh my god his head boinged off the ring post and Mar Marco is still showing signs of life even after that intense suplex from Bullstorm it's incredible to see how much life this man has in him and he is here to destroy Eddie X and get back in that ring and then win the match. This is the strategy because he knows that, I mean, the cards were against him after that Warden powerbomb, which Warden is not here to officiate anything or inter interfere with anything. We need to keep this going. Wow. Oh, Enziguri. Marco wants to get his hands on Chris Sean and he will do whatever it takes to get his hands on Chris Sean. And man, Eddie X is a broken man. And Marco is gonna try and end it off right now. What an elbow to the gut. He's picking him up, ready to continue the momentum, but Eddie X. Oh man, Eddie X about to do a dirty deeds. That is it if he does it. That is it. That's end game right there. Done, done. Rebel Kid needs to come save this one. Rebel Kid's there to save the pin. That would have been the end of the match. Eddie X. Oh, they're coming to get. Oh, man, Eddie X now. Done with Rebel Kid. Bullstorm. Bullstorm's out of the match, too. I think he's still beating up Rebel Kid. It's just Marco alone again, man. It's just all been him. If Marco can land this major move, that's the end of the match. Phoenix Splash incoming. He hits it on Eddie X. Wow. Done and done. Is he going to do it before Bullstorm comes? One, two. Damn. He's by himself. There's not much Marco can do. And look at Marco going, come on. This is an intense match. It can go either way to be out. Oh, I thought that was his finisher again. I would have been fucking shocked. Here he comes, Eddie X, tired as hell, tagging in. Oh, no, he's not allowing Bullstorm to be tagged in, knowing that he has a lot of health. He wants to finish off the guy that has no health. He is now in the corner of Rebel Kid. Marco needs to make this important tag to Rebel Kid. Oh, he's not going to. Marco is just going to make sure... This is all him tonight. What a match. If that's it, fair game. I think Marco knows there's more to do. Oh, no. Here we go. Good night. Bye-bye. 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 One, two, three. What a match.
Rebel oh, no, Kid. That was a little unsafe. To me, but... That was an unsafe match. Wow. Marco pretty much was just a shield for, or Rebel Kid was pretty much the shield for Marco that whole match. There was no, there was only an opportunity at the end of the match to tag in Rebel Kid, but he didn't do it. Here they are, pass through, passing through Chris Sean's wall to get to Chris Sean. I mean, good shit. This is exactly what they needed to get to where they need to be. We're going to continue the show right now. 